he doesn't come to my table and say anything, because if he does, it's not going to be the day. How many of you have experienced that before? Now, when you sit down in that classroom and you say, please do not say anything to the teacher. Please, please, please do not say anything. And as soon as you open your eyes and you blink, the teacher right in front of your face. What's the matter with you, son? What's the matter for you, young lady? Y'all experienced that before? Yes. You know why? <laughs> You know why that actually happens? You know why? Because you speak it into existence. That's why. Whatever you speak, whether it be negative or positive, it will come to pass. You're saying, you know what? I'm going to go to college and I'm going to be a success because I'm going to be more qualified. And you really mean it? The universe knows whether you're writing a blind check or not. And you have to remember that. You have to remember to stay focused. If you want to own that clothing store, start working to get it done now. Because you do need the proper business model for whatever it is that you want to do. If you want to be a garbage collector, by the way, they make a lot of money. You've got to put the proper business model in place to ensure that that happens. Now, anyone has any questions? Anyone has any questions? Really? Good. Let me tell you that. your name? Come on, I'm a sense of humor. <laughs> you gotta feed John, man. Who wants to serve him for lunch? Huh? Yes. I'm not very good. Is the food good? Is it good? Is it not good? No, not at all. Not at all. <laughs> Do they serve like jerk chicken? No. Does anyone know what conch is? Yes. Conch, pronounced conch. Anyone knows? Anyone ever been to the Bahamas before? Don't lie, the Bahamas rocks, right? Yeah, they do. You ever been to the beach? Ever saw like, any of you ever saw like crystal clear water? Yeah. That's it. How about white sand? Like just salmon, it feels like powder on your feet. Yeah. Let me tell you, we got this real, we got this cool island, right? It's called the Lutra. Anyone wearing pink? Pink. Anyone wearing pink? Okay, you see this, this shirt, right? It's like a faded pink right here with New York on it. Imagine if you walk the beach with sand, that color. No lie, it's in the Bahamas. It's like, like the water right, it isn't even deep. Like you can walk straight out to the ocean for miles, and the sand is like pink. You know what I mean? So, learn to travel. Make sure you go visit the Bahamas. Anyhow, while I'm here, before I go off someday. Y'all like to dance? Yeah. yeah. Well, I'm not a dancer. I'm not a dancer. Well, I came up with this song called The Caribbean Slack because I wanted, number one, for people to unite, people to get in shape, and I wanted to bring something different to music. And um, I want to teach it to you guys, and um, you're going to love it, and I want you to learn it, I want you to live it, and I want you to share it with your friends. All right? So I'm going to show you one time exactly how it goes. But what I want you to do is, I want you to stand up. All right? Should I stop? How can you guys have so much energy when you say that? <laughs> All right, so here's what I'm gonna do. Y'all remember my name, right? Y'all remember my name? Yeah, I know. If you gotta look at the paper to remember my name. <laughs> Who is that guy? The detective, let's give him a round of applause. Do you watch the TV show Law and Order? Yes. Yeah. CSI? Yes. Yeah. CSI. Miami, New York, or Vegas? Vegas. Vegas. Vegas? Vegas, Vegas by far. You think Vegas is better than Miami? Yes, yeah. Uh, I hear you. Okay. So let's go see you. Anyone using YouTube? 